Now, a fledgling company in Clevedon is about to take the world of education by storm with its brand new version of a kind of 3D printer. Yes, it's perfect for design and technology lessons. Students who are drawing up images on the computer can then finish off the process by making up their designs for real out of plastic. Yeah, amazing. And apparently the technology has been reworked so schools can afford it, as Amanda Parr reports. It's just won what's known as an education Oscar for bringing top manufacturing technology into a classroom context. So, quick master class. Design an object on your computer. Feed in the info to the new machine. It spools in this blue plastic, heats it up in the red nozzly bit, and in a 3D grid system kind of way, squirts it out layer by layer to build up your object. Any idea what this is going to be yet? It's a concept that's never been brought into schools except with very expensive machinery and uh, what this has done is it's made it accessible to almost every school in the UK. Uh, it enables students to visualise their designs in 3D. First sight of the machine is always wow. Uh, it's, it's so strange to see a, a fairly simple looking machine print something as, as complex as it is capable of doing. It brings things to life really makes you be able to hold it in your hand and uh, actually see what it's going to be like. It makes it more realistic because like usually you just see it on the screen and you don't really, like you model it but it's never the same. So. The project was picked up from Bath University. Bits from Bytes in Clevedon has redeveloped it for schools, made it transparent and much cheaper. Now schools across the world are starting to pick it up. There's a way to go, but you know what they say from small acorns. Well, if you'd come to see us two years ago, we'd have been based in the back of the Inns garage. Um, we've now got the unit you can see around you that's up and running, um, and production has scaled up from making a few kits, which was just going to be hobby evenings and weekends, into full-time production at the moment. And we're aiming to be selling, uh, sending out about 200, 200 kits per month from immediately. So can you tell what it is yet? Let me put you out of your misery. It's Star Wars anti-hero Darth Vader. And here is one someone else made earlier. May the Force be with you.